Uh, good morning. It's uh, Tuesday the 19th of October 2021 and you join us in Glen Shiel. Uh, we're parked just to the east of the Clonny Inn and we're going to walk a couple of Monroes to the north. Uh, so we're just heading in here and out. Nice autumn colours. Forecast is not terrific so we're not expecting clear tops. See the track down the front here, that's the track that takes you into Glen Affleck Youth Hostel. Hour and a half, couple of hours walk. Oh, we're getting there, it's all height at the beginning. But the hill's starting to lie back. So things are a wee bit easier. That's us up the steep bit of the shoulder. Now heading up towards the Monroe. About 1.8 kilometres to go. Got a good bit of height already taken there and out. No, we're not going to hang around, we're just going to head north along the ridge uh, towards the second wind rope. That's the top, and then we'll go down to the right once we leave that top, head out to the mineral. And get a better look at the wee ridge out now, out here. You see the path just here, we're dropping down into the don't mind the quarry. Once you're heading west and you pick up the path that we saw that we crossed at the beginning. That's just uh, my last rise to the second mineral, about 150 metres to go.
I head back to the, the coal, drop in the quarry and see cup of tea. This has just dropped down off the ridge, so we have a cup of tea. But the day certainly was probably better than we expected. We look at the scenery. This is the second mineral, and then this is looking north, Glen Affric. Uh, drop down to the track, and then we. We go to the left, which is walking south back to the car. So looking over to Kishtu and Bonnie Hill. One of the smallest cairns I think on a Monroe Kishtu. There's a handful of stones. Now we just curve round and we're going heading down that way. You can see that's us picked up the path. Uh, this is the path that takes you through to Glen Affric Youth Hostel and it turns into a track just shortly. So we've got about four kilometres to get back to the car. Well, that's us just about back at the car. Uh, 13 kilometre day, five and a quarter hours, so really good. Good appreciation of the hills, so, and the weather actually wasn't as bad as forecast, so, so good. So, many thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye.